Hey guys, Marissa at KitchenTableStamper.com. Today I'm going to run you through this fun little treat um, hanger. I'm using the Stampin' Up! Cheerful Tags um, die set and we're going to use this fun hanger tag right here. This is kind of originally decided to make a um, bottle tag for like a bottle of wine for a hostess. I saw this fun little treat hanger treat and thought how fun would that be to make for you guys. All right, so let's get started here. You will need hang your stockings from the Stampin' Up! Holiday collection for the little two from greeting there. I also used the um, Christmas stockings die set. Love this thing. We're going to do this fun little pattern stocking today and the white one. All right. So, um, the tag right here, this little guy, is from Stampin' Up's Baker's Box. I love this little tag. I already did all the die cutting from Real Red. You need two of these tags. And the first thing I'm going to do is turn one over and add Fast Fuse all over the back of it here. And I like how gluing your treat in with the fast fuse. All right, I used a one by eight treat bag. I don't think Stampin' Up! has one by eight treat bags anymore, but I have a few left after making these for the teachers. So if you go over to kitchentablestamper.com and leave a comment, let me know that you saw it. I'll be giving away some three packs of these one by eight treat bags, just in case um, you'd like to try this at home. All right, so I've fast fused my candy treat bag in between the tags. I'm gonna add just a little bit more fast fuse going over that bag. And I'm gonna glue the second real red tag right there over the top. Okay. And then let's build a fun little medallion here. I've got an Emerald Envy circle, Whisper White, and some presents and pine cones here. I'm going to adhere the presents and pine cones pattern to the Whisper White and the Whisper White to the Emerald Envy. And then dimensionals. Gotta love those. All right, now I've got my fun little stocking. I'll cut out an Emerald Envy and one in Whisper White. I'm gonna turn that guy over and add some green Tombow adhesive to the toe and the heel, and then I'll just do some random lines here and there up the sides. I like to go very thin and kind of use the nozzle to spread it for this project. Okay, and flip it. touch the green to the white so the Emerald Envy and the white are now together but then I turn it over and burnish it because if you burnish it upside down you can get some of that glue if there's any that seeps out and it just kind of gets blotted onto your work pad instead of spread all over your stocking. All right next up I have the real red and I cut a little topper there for my stocking. and. some of these little edge pieces. They're perfect size for that. Here I like to pick this guy up because the cuff is just a little bit wider than the stocking and I find if I look at the top edge I get it on even the first time instead of off to the right or the left one side. 
Okay, next up, I have some holly and holly berries that I cut from the Hang Your Stockings dies. This is um, Mint Macron and Pearl Red again. Glue the berries to the leaves and then flip it and glue the whole holly to the stocking. I'm gonna add some glue here, but only in the center section of the stocking, because you notice that the, the cuff is above the circle medallion and the toe hangs off. So avoid the cuff, avoid the toe, and then glue that little guy on. Okay, last little detail here. I've got that tag cut from Whisper White and some red and white baker's twine or cord. Um, early espresso stamp pot. I just stuck my thumb in it. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. I'm clean now. All right. Two from. Ink it up. This is from Hang Your Stockings. And I'm going to go to as far as the left as possible because it's a bitty little tag. You're going to have to write small. All right. And the one eighth inch hole punch. There's still more ink on my hands. Okay. Eighth inch hole punch. Going to punch the tag right in the center there. I've got a nice long length, probably too long, of baker's cord. I'm gonna go loop through the back and then through the loop I'm going to pull the tails and I've got a glue dot here put a little glue dot on the back of that tag add it to my medallion and then I'm going to tie a sweet little bow my piece of cording was way too long. That's okay. There it is. Trim off the excess, of which there is much. And there they are, our fun little candy holders, or treat hangers, or whatever. Um, this one I embellished with a little bit of uh, red rhinestones. You could use the fun um, red sequins, or just give it a little sparkle if you like. There's that emerald envy one. All right, if you've got any questions about this, you can email me, marissa at kitchentablestamper.com. Thanks for watching.